Hi besties! Welcome back to my channel. So today we're in a little bit different area so the lighting is going to be a little different. I don't have very good lighting in my living room but I thought maybe it'd be kind of cool to have a little bit of change of scenery so I came upstairs to the living room and yeah so that's where we're at today. So again if the lighting looks off that is why. But I have a pretty big haul today. I got a couple of uh, deliveries from Timu today that I kind of want to go through and a lot of it is um, shipping supplies or friend mail supplies and things small business supplies things like that um, so I hope you stick around for that there is some other stuff too there's some jewelry and a couple articles of clothing but mainly shipping and so I know a lot of you do friend mail and you're interested in friend mail so there might be something in here that's of value to you or maybe somebody that you know so anyway let's just get right into this I will link my items in the comment section I'll pin a comment so check there um yeah I don't know what else to say except for that so yeah I got two big bags so <clears throat> I'm gonna try and make it go as quick as possible but we'll see what we can do. So maybe go get a drink and a snack. I haven't done a long haul in quite a while. So, all right, let's just get into this. Um, so the first item, and I think I got like three of these. They are like um, shipping boxes. These are $9.59 for $10. Um, so when I get to the other ones, I won't like go through these again. But they're pink shipping boxes. I probably won't even be able to open this to show you, but they're not very, like, thick. But I, so I started, like, a little side business called, well, it's not really my company, but it's called Pink Zebra, and they do, like, home fragrance, kind of like Scentsy. But when I want to send out, like, samples or maybe somebody buys a little packet off of me, I needed some, like, smaller boxes. So these fold up to, like, the perfect size uh, for those uh, wax melts and things so yeah that's why I got these so you get a pack of 10 for 10 bucks which I did not think that that was bad at all I thought that was a great deal okay so this is probably the most expensive item I've ever bought on Timu in my life this was like $57 now I've got a couple of price adjustments on it and I'm not gonna like put it together right now I guess you could say but it's a thermal label printer um, I did get some thermal labels too, and you have to download an app to use this. Um, so they give you the instructions on how to use it. They give you some of the labels, and then it, <laughs> of course I got a pink one. You know me, I had to get a pink one, but, so yeah, it's, haven't even used it or taken it out of the box. I'm going to try and set it up later, so if I can get it set up and I need to print a label, I think what I will do is, um, do a short video on how easy or hard it was to get to work um now i use pirate ship to ship everything so i'm not sure how that coordinates with this i'm really completely in the dark with these thermal label printers so if you've bought one off of timu before let me know what you use it for or if it was easy to set up it seems like it's just a matter of downloading a app but i'm not sure how once you get the app on your phone how do i send my labels to this printer. I guess I'll figure it out, right? Or I hope so, anyways. Okay, next item are these bubble envelopes. Um, I thought they were pretty cool looking. They're like an iridescent color, and they were $3.99. Um, so again, if I want to send out samples to people, or maybe someone just buys like one bag of soy wax melts from me, um, I could send it in these. So you get... How many is in here? 10 maybe I guess by looking at it 10 for $3.99 but they're kind of small you know but th that's all the bigger I need but they've got a little bit of iridescence to them a little holographic thing going on there so I th thought those were kind of cool um but yeah $3.99 for 10 of these I don't think that's bad because when I was when I was making freshies I was spending so much more than that on shipping supplies like way more than that Okay, I think I got this. No, I didn't get this for free. I lied. I was I was gonna say that, but I didn't. This was three nineteen. And sorry if the lighting is changing. I thought the sun was gonna come out, and it's been kind of raining here all day. And of course, now that I'm starting to do a video, it's gonna go to crap. So I just need some storage to put some things in. Now this thing is tiny. 
<laughs> this is all the bigger it is. I probably could have got something like this, a Dollar Tree, for, that's bigger for a lot more. To, or, I mean, a lot less, I should say. Because this was $3.19. $3.19 for this thing? I mean, it is not very big at all. But I, I thought, well, I need some place to, like, put my shipping supplies, you know, so I can keep it, you know, kind of, what do I want to say, organized. So that's kind of why I got this. But $3.19 for that? I don't know, guys. That seems like an awful lot for that. Don't you think? Okay, next up is this hair bow. I saw um, Faith's Champagne Taste on a Beer Budget get something similar to this. And I've been eyeballing these, and I'm like, oh gosh, it looked so cute when she took it out of the package. So, it's like a hair clip, claw clip, and then it's just got this, like, ribbon kind of bow on each side. No, it's a little bit, it needs judged because it's a little bit, um... You know, eh, it's like crisp, crispy. Yeah, no, not crispy. It's all, it needs floofed, okay? But the, the print is like a black with black hearts, like a, so it's really pretty. But yeah, I thought it'd be pretty like in the back of a hair, you know, in the back of your hair with this like ribbon coming off it. I don't know. Anyway, they were two forty nine, so I thought that was really pretty. Okay, next is this item. It's shipping tape, and they give you the tape dispenser and three rolls, and I got, got it in pink. $7.98 for this. I don't think that was too bad, I mean, depending on how the tape is, um, because the shipping tape I get at Dollar Tree, I hate it. Um, but the shipping tape I get at the post office, I love. So it kind of depends on the tape. So I'm hoping that this will like be decent enough for me to do some shipping. Here's to hoping, but $7.98 for this. I don't know, what do you guys think? Was that like not a good price or a good price or not? Okay, next is this, <laughs> it's like paper shreds that I'm gonna use inside the boxes. So you get, I don't even know if it says on here how many ounces, but it's $2.69 for this bag. Now, Dollar Tree probably sells this stuff for the same price. So I'm going to have to check the ounces because I cannot read what this says. It says like, I don't, I can't even see what the size is, but I'm going to check the size on this and then maybe run into Dollar Tree because if I can get the same amount for at Dollar Tree for $1.25 and this was almost three bucks. So I don't know. It feels kind of heavy. So there's probably a lot in there, but it's literally paper shreds. Like, I mean, what the heck? It's, it's literally paper shreds. All right, next is um, just some stickers. These were $3.99. I'm thinking there's like 100 in here, maybe. But they just say fragile, handle, handle with care, or fragile if you're French. <laughs> I'm just kidding, I'm just kidding. So one time, on one of my videos, I said that. I said, oh, it's, it's French, it says fragile. And someone was like, that isn't French. I'm like, I know, it's off the movie, A Christmas Story. Do any of you... Did you guys get it when I said that in my other video? It says fragile. Like, I don't know. I, but anyway, they say handle with care, fragile. Okay, next, I got these for free. And I'm not quite sure what I'm going to do with these yet. I thought they were going to be actually smaller than this. They're, I thought maybe they were going to be like postcard size. But there is like 36 in here, I think. But they are all prints of churches. And initially, I thought I was going to um, maybe use these as postcards or something like that but I don't know now because they're bigger than I thought so I don't know if I'm gonna like write notes on them or use them as you know scrap paper for something I don't know but I love them I think they're gorgeous I love the print I, I used to paint churches like this um but yeah I think they're amazing like look at them they're just very kind of moody and fall giving moody fall vibes but yeah I love them I think they're great so they would be great for junk journaling um honestly you could probably frame these honestly they're like five by seven I would say get a bunch of five by seven frames if you really like them so I don't know I mean I'm not real sure what I'm gonna do with these now but yeah they were they're really pretty and I got them for free so you gotta love that here are some more of those boxes so I'm not gonna go over them but they're the same price $9.59 and you get 10 in, in a sleeve here, so I got like 30 boxes in all. Next, I got a, um, this was $6.79. It's a plastic, what do I want to say? You got to put this thing together. It holds thermal paper tape rolls, I think. So 
when you have a thermal printer, it just pulls the labels. So I just have to figure out how to put it together. So wish me luck for that. But yeah, it's just a plastic. It's like a spool, really. And you just put your, like a roll. I think it, I think you can either use a roll or the sheets. So, but it, this is kind of, let me see. I don't know if you guys can even really see this, but down here would be like the finished product. So you can lay your tape in here, or if you have a roll, you can put it on the thing. So I don't know, but yeah, that was $6.79, so not exactly cheap, right? Okay, then I got this set of paper shreds to put in the boxes, and they were $1.78. So this one was cheaper, but I, it feels lighter than that other one. So, But again, I need to check the size of these, because this look like, looks like it says 50 grams. So I do not know how much the Dollar Tree, like how much the Dollar Tree ones weigh, so I could be wasting money on these. I, I really need to check that out. And then I got some black, same paper, same thing, paper shreds, um, same size, 50 grams, $1.78. They're just literally paper shreds for shipping purposes. And then I got, wow guys, I'm actually flying through this. <laughs> Here I thought it was gonna be this super long haul. Let's hydrate for a minute. Let's just take a break, relax, catch our breath. Mm, I love this kombucha. It's Dr. Brew um, Peach Punch. Tastes like peach, prickly pear, and green tea. It's really good. And good for the gut. Okay, anyway, these are like a leopard, pink leopard print, and they were $2.53. It doesn't say how many sheets are in here though, so I'm not real sure. Um, it doesn't feel like very many, but I like the print and it's it's kind of a theme thing with me obviously here, like pink, black, red, you know, all that. Okay, I got this because I was trying to find a big tote bag, which I'm sure I probably have one here, to like put some supplies into when I have to travel with them. So this is like a big tote bag insert or a big purse insert. And this thing is way bigger than I thought it was going to be. But it was $7.18. And it's it feels kind of like felt. <laughs> or I don't know. I don't know what you want to call this thing. But so it looks like this. And there's little pockets down in here. But you just sit this down inside your tote bag or inside your purse or whatever. And then you have like little pockets, places to put pens or whatnot. And then if you switch out your bags, you can just pull this out. But it's got pockets like even in the front right here. Um, there's a couple places for pens, all kinds of things. So if I can find a bag to fit this in, I will, I will definitely be using that. Okay, this is the exact one I think I saw Faith get. Um, again, this is another hair bow clip. It was $1.78. I just thought it looked so cute. And like I said, I was eyeballing them. So I'm like, oh, I'm going to get that. So this is what it looks like. It's just, you know, a uh, hair clip. And then it's got this like bandana type of look to it. Really cute. I think it will look super cute like in the hair. Really light and soft. I just thought it would be really cute. Like just to pull your hair up, like have like this at the bottom of a bun or something. Yeah, super cute. Okay, last item in the first bag. This was free, but <laughs> it, it, I feel like it's free for a reason, okay? Um, all right, well, we'll try and open it and I'll try and show you what it is, but I'm not super impressed with the look of it right out of the gate. I needed something to sit my supplies in and so it's literally just a big like it's a zippered i don't know what you want to call it you know what i mean like it's a big zippered thing box a big zippered box you can put like blankets and clothes and all kinds of things in but the top part where you see this dark orange color it's a separate area and then this is the separate area so i needed just like a big bin to put stuff in and like cover it up. So I don't know, I might, I might, I don't know about this. Like I feel like I should just get, go to Walmart and get like a plastic tub and then maybe put this down inside of it. I'm not sure. I mean, I'm glad it was free. I didn't pay for it cause it's not very sturdy. Like I don't, there's nothing, there's nothing hard in here. Like I could put, I could probably put like some, um, anyway, I have like some boxes I could break down and like use in the bottom of this to kind of sturdy it up. Uh, so I don't know about this. I mean, it was free, so 
it was free. Okay, so just one more bag left. Wow, I go through bags so fast, but then I realize I buy some of the same stuff. So maybe that's why I go through it so fast. <laughs> but anyways, this is um, like some wrap that you put around things. It like blows up kind of. I'll show you. I'll show you what I mean. But anyways, it's 1052 and you get a big roll and you get the fragile stickers. Um, Fragile. I'm sorry for anyone that can't take a joke out there. But anyway, so you get a bunch of fragile stickers. The cat just set off her feeder. That's what that noise was. But so it's this kind of material. It's paper. Oh gosh, I don't even know how to start this without ripping it. It looks like this and then you kind of pull it. You pull it like this and then you wrap the item inside of here and it kind of, you know, it, it, you got to pull this stuff apart though. There's I don't know how good this is going to be, though, because it's, like, already pulling apart. But, you know, you can squish it a little bit and make it so it cushions whatever item you have. Because I have some, like, glass items and some ceramic items, so I was hoping that I could use that. So I don't know if I can use that or not. We'll see. Um, it seems like it might be okay, though. So And then I just got an extra roll of the pink tape because I didn't realize that I, that I bought those three rolls. So one roll is three bucks, though. So that thing was a bargain for three rolls and a dispenser for eight, but this was three bucks. So I don't know. I guess I'm planning on using a lot of tape, <laughs> apparently. Okay, so then I got some of the thermal labels. They were $3.89. And as you can see, they're put together. So they will go on that inside that thing and pull through that I bought the plastic dispenser, I guess you could say. So that's what these are, $3.89 for those. If you're wondering what pink zebra is um it's like a home scent kind of like scentsy but non-toxic to your pets to your kids all of that and i have a link to my vip group i think in my description if you if that's where i post all of my stuff about pink zebra so you know if you want to stop over there i go live like once a week we can chat you know whatever it's just kind of a fun group no you know you don't have to buy anything you can just hang out okay so again more of the Leopard print paper. They call this color uh, khaki. And they call this color pink. Khaki and pink. I don't really know why. This color, it's more like a rose gold almost. It looks kind of metallic. This one doesn't look metallic. But they were both $2.53. And so they're going to be going into some packaging. And then, let's see here. Oh, I got this now. I don't know why I bought this, but it was $2.19, but it's like that weather stripping tape. And our bathroom window, it tends to kind of let air in around it. I don't, I don't know. They must have replaced that window in there at some point in time. So I thought what I'd do is when it starts getting cold, I could put this tape like around the window and then hopefully keep some of the cold air out. Hopefully. All right, let me reach back in the bag. These are a set of nails. They were $1.98. Let me see if I can get them out. Hopefully I can show them to you. And hopefully this whole thing hasn't been... If this whole video has been blurry, I'm literally going to die. Because I can't see myself filming. So they are like a cat eye. And then there's some dots on them that are red, white, and green. So I guess they're probably going to be a little bit of a Christmas nail. So hopefully it's focusing, um, but they're kind of, I mean, either way, it, I think they'll be okay. So, I mean, I could probably wear them any time of the year, really, but they were $1.98. I'll save them for Christmas if I want to wait till then, if I don't want to wear red, white, and green. Although, honestly, you can barely tell that they're red, white, and green by looking at them. Um, and then I got another set of the magnetic lashes. These were $4.47. I'm still trying to figure out like what style works best for me because I bought a couple that are just too, what do I want to say, too fluffy, too thick, too all the things. So they give you this to put them on with. And let's look at these. And I can tell you by looking if they're going to be okay or not. I, I can just tell. So they give you a little case. And again, these are pretty easy once you get the hang of it. But, you know, you got to get the hang of it, you know. So, there's only one pair in here. So, okay, these look like I would like them. So, this is what they look like. They are kind of wispy, you know. Um, yeah, I, I think these look really nice. They look pretty natural. 
and kind of wispy. So that's my thing. I like those. But they come with this little case and it actually has a mirror on it. So that's nice. And then you get the applicator too. And the app, you really got to figure it out. Like it, it says up and down, like it's right here. But <laughs> they are hard to figure out. But once you get the hang of it and once you know how to do it, it it's not too bad. It, it gets easier with time. I'll say that. Okay, let me dump this bag out on the table here. And we'll get rid of that. Maybe Delilah will play in it. So, um, let's let's just go with this. Because this is my free item. I got, like, two free items with this order. So, it's this folding fan. And I actually have two of these. These are great in, like, a bathroom or a kitchen area where you need, like, a little bit of extra airflow. Um, or maybe near your bed somewhere or on your desk at work or something like that. Um, so, what you do is you get, like, a little sticky tab. Let me show you this because they're actually really nice. I actually bought one and then I got this one for free. So you get a cord and then it hangs on the wall. So you get this to put on your wall and then you hang the fan up on your wall. Let me put this in here so it'll, there. So the sticky tab's right here. This is the fan and then this fan moves so you can like adjust it to whichever way you want. And then, I think I've showed this before, I know I have, but the, the on button's back here. It's probably not charged up, but it charges up. So you don't have to use the cord like the whole time, but it, it puts out a pretty good airflow too. So yeah, I recommend these and I don't know how I got it for free. So I might take this one to work with me. Um, I'm not sure though. I mean, it's about to be winter. So, but Brian always loves to have a fan going in the bedroom. So he might like that by the bed. So maybe I'll see if he wants that one by the bed. Okay, so then I got this set of magnetic lashes. Now this one was $2.98. It doesn't come with any applicator or container or anything like that. It's just in this box. Um, but I think there's two pairs in here. Let me check. Yeah, yeah, they're it. Yeah, so there's two pairs. These don't look too bad. Um, they're like a cat eye type of, you know, situation there. Uh, so yeah. Kind of wispy, cat eye kind of look to them. Okay, then I got some of these coffee clips. And I'm going to use these in a giveaway um, in my group, I think, in my VIP group. You get four of the clips. They are 218, and these are stinking adorable. These would be good for, like, journals or something like that. Can you peel the back off of these or something? Are these sticky? I don't know. See how one side looks like this and one side looks like that? Like, why is that like that? It's almost like, it's almost like you can peel it off, but I don't know why. Like, why? I'm not sure why. I don't know. But they're really cute coffee clips. Looks like that. But yeah, I don't know. Maybe this side is sticky, or maybe they just have it covered up for some reason. I'm not sure. But you get four clips. So I'm going to put, like, stuff like this in giveaways for, like, oh, look, the sun's going to come out now since I'm almost done. Thanks, sunlight. So, you know, for giveaways and things like that. Okay, then this is also going to be kind of like a giveaway thing. Um, it's $1.73. These are some fall stickers. I love stickers. I don't know about you guys, but I love stickers. And I thought that I could, like, get, put some of these in a giveaway as well. So, I don't know. They're just a bunch of fall stickers. <laughs> look at this little bird. That is adorable. Oh, my gosh. Look how cute this one is. Bless you, Kermit. A little leaf. Like, just a bunch of different fall stickers. These are so stinking cute. So stinking cute. Look at that. They're just really cute. These would be so cute on something. And there, there's a lot of different ones. Sorry, the cat's getting into the bag again. There's a little fox, and then they're, like, different ones. Oh, my gosh, here's a pair of, like, boots. Cute. So, yeah, a bunch of different... <laughs> <laughs> They're just adorable. How cute is that? Just really cute. Here's a little pumpkin spice love one. Really cute. Really cute. So these are adorable. So they will be going in a giveaway. Or, you know, I'll be giving some things away. Because I have a, like, fall, um, fall kind of Halloween giveaway coming up. I don't really celebrate Halloween, but I wanted to do kind of like a fall giveaway. Prior to Halloween, so... All right, then I got these stickers, and these are adorable. They are little gingerbread men. They were $2.53. They're little gingerbread men in, like, coffee cups. Oh, these are so cute. Let me see if I'm holding it right. 
and Delilah's chewing on the bag down here. These are, I love gingerbread men. Like, that's my jam right there. Gingerbread men. Super cute. So those will probably be going into some type of giveaway as well. I love stickers. I don't know. I Maybe I'm just weird. But I think stickers are so stinking cute. Okay, then I got these little bags for other, like, maybe I might put the stickers in here when I send them away in a, in a box or for a giveaway because... I don't want the stickers to get jacked up, or maybe a, there's like a pair of earrings or a bracelet or something like that. So I got these little bags. They were two seventeen. I'm not sure how many are in here. Maybe like ten or twenty. Probably more like twenty. But they look like this. They're smell proof, so anything in here won't like you know the scent will keep. And then they're kind of like holographic. So yeah, that that was the only reason I picked those up, is so I could put like giveaway stuff in them. And then I got two rings. I'm having a hot flash, guys. Bear with me. So I got this ring. It was $3.91. Now, I feel like Timu's rings are kind of getting a little bit expensive, okay? But the thing I hate about it is I never really know what they're going to be like until I get them. Like, I bought some really nice rings on Timu that for pretty darn cheap. And then I'll get one for like 3 bucks that I don't even really like. So I don't know. But this one was, again, $3.91, and it's two pieces. See, I don't like this one as much as some of the other ones. So it's two pieces that go together, supposedly, but I'm having trouble even getting them together. There's the one piece. Hopefully it focuses. Here's the other piece. And it looks like you can slide this in here, but I don't, I don't know, guys. I don't know, it, it's not very sparkly or anything, It's and it's kind of, I don't know, I feel, I don't know, like, I don't know, it's not as sparkly as it should be for four bucks, I can tell you that, Oh, and it's hard to get on and off, and it's almost like these aren't lining up properly, I mean, I don't know, I mean, oh yeah, I don't know, for $3.91, just not my favorite ring. So, I don't know, maybe it's just the lighting in here. That could very well be. So, this one was $2.42. Alright, if I can get it out of here. $2.42. This one doesn't look as good either. Now, I, again, is it because I'm up here? I don't know, but I made a mess out of my living room. Brian's out of town or he would literally die if he saw this living room right now. Literally die. Okay, let's cut this sucker open. Okay, so it's three pieces. Um, let me put it on. Let's see what it looks like on. It's a square. It's it's kind of pretty. It, it's like three bands, and the, the bottom and top band have like a row of, you know, not diamonds. They're a row of whatever on them, and then you got the big square right there. So I don't know. It's okay. I like that one. I like it. It's very pretty. I, th I feel like, you know, so maybe like, wow, that's a nice ring, you know? Okay, so the last two items are clothes. Um, so I got this. It's like a shawl type of thing. So maybe I'll put it on, I guess. Hermit's down here chewing on a bag. So I don't think these are like plus size per se, but they're one size. So this one was $13.59. Um, so it looks like this. It's like orange and turquoise blue, which I thought was really pretty. And let's see if I can figure out how this goes. And then, so this is, you can switch it to the other side, which is turquoise and purple, or keep it like orange and purple. But it's just a big, long, kind of like shawl that you put over your shoulders. Okay, let's, I have a black shirt on, so I don't know what this will look like, but... So you just put it like over your shoulders, like so. Honestly, for one size, I mean, it just, it fits pretty well. Let me back up. The cats are like, what are you doing with your life? So, you know, this is what it looks like. It's like nice and long and nice and big. So yeah, this is what it looks like. You probably can't even see my head. I don't know. I can't see what I'm filming. Okay, so that's what this looks like. 
it's really nice. So in the winter time, it's almost like wearing a big blanket. And it's nice and long, so I love that. So yeah, I like that. I'm probably going to get orange all over my black sweater from that. The cats are like, <laughs> the cats are like, you made a mess out of this room. I know, I have. I know, Kermie. Okay. So this is kind of the same idea. This was $12.68. Again, it's like one, one size kind of fits all type of deal. So this one is, it's like gray. Okay. And pink and, okay, I had to find the collar area, which is right here. You could wear this either way. You could wear it on this side or you could probably wear it on this side. Like so. Let me get my hair out of the way situate myself it's just like a shawl kind of but they're really big they're really kind of like big i can't feel the back but you know it's just like a nice piece to wear and then you can always tie you know kind of throw this over your shoulder or whatever maybe even belt it if you wanted like belt it right here but i yeah i don't know i love these because it adds like a layer but it's not super bulky but it's really comfortable. There is that. I hope, huh, I hope I'm not blurry the whole way through this video. If I am, I guess you won't be seeing it because I won't even upload it, but I just wanted to try out a new area. So you guys, <laughs> I thought maybe you guys would think it's cool to have the video in a different area. But thank you guys so much for joining me. I really appreciate it. If you like this video, please click like, click subscribe and make sure you're subscribed because I know YouTube has a way of like unsubscribing people, but you know, please make sure you're subscribed, click like, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.